<laughs> well, it has come to the end of our camping adventures. Mm. I'm sorry we have missed the past two days. We've been busy and tired, and <laughs> but it's been a really good trip. We, um, while we've been here, we've had two sessions of premarital counseling because we're here with my pastor and his wife and a lot of our, um, my church family. So it's good. We just talked about like what roles do we think we're going to play in, in our marriage and we talked about money and stuff like that. So just really good conversations, just sitting around the fire talking and really good and then we went to the lake and played volleyball and Aston is so good <laughs> I am terrible not true <laughs> she was getting one. better <laughs> she did really well. it's just never been my sport but after the second day the eighth game I was finally starting to get the hang of it um Whenever I would serve, though, I still looked like a dancer and, like, kick my leg up in the back. <laughs> Do a nice little attitude <laughs> while serving the ball. But it was good. So it's been just a good time of, like, fellowship with everyone and haven't had to do much planning. It's been nice to just rest. And the first day I just slept so much. I was so tired. My brain was exhausted. Um, but Austin got me a hammock for my birthday. <laughs> He slept in that <laughs> instead of. I slept in her birthday present. Because I had an air mattress. Such a great gift idea. <laughs> yeah, she had an air mattress on a nice cot and everything, living like a queen. <laughs> that was good though. It was comfortable. So we've been getting a lot of beef from my pastor about the notebook picture that we we took he says that there should be no premarital straddling no straddling <laughs> he's just joking but so i randomly send the straddling photos to his phone <laughs> occasionally <laughs> so and then this morning we i was i gave austin I started eating a pear and then gave it to Austin because it was too hard. Like, you know, I just wasn't re ready to eat. Um, <laughs> he again looks over and he's like, What's this premarital pear sharing? <laughs> <laughs> so it's it's been fun getting, being the butt end of all the jokes, but it's good. Everyone's really excited for us and just wants to talk with us and hear about you know where we're going to be living and what are our colors and so it's just been been cool it's been good so this next few weeks are going to be hard please keep us in your prayers because i head back to tennessee to for spanish um summer school type thing so that i can graduate in august so I'll be in Tennessee for a week and a half, and then I leave for Puerto Rico for 11 days on June 18th. So it's going to be a little, a little hard. I've already been to Colorado this summer for 10 days for school, um, and now I'm leaving on another trip. Um, and it's kind of close. I get back on the 29th of June. We get married on the 11th of July. So it's kind of cutting it. <laughs> but we have all the big stuff taken care of so just pray that we we stay calm and we don't get stressed out and um, yeah that we just you know the people that were asking to help us we can just rely on them and um, that everything just comes together yeah. that's so, gonna be great yeah yeah we don't just miss each other so much <laughs> we'll be fine <laughs> no it will be hard but it'll be okay. We have to make the blog every day, so yeah. So that's gonna be interesting. We have a way that we're thinking we'll make the blog while I'm gone. So uh, stay tuned for that. <laughs> All right. Bye. Thirty-three days. Woo woo.